I use, just make sure you actually wash your face in the morning. Well, that sounds so stupid, but um, I just use a warm mitt. I got these from Amazon, but I think my favourite are from Laura Dirt. Um, and I just love how you can kind of really get into all the corners and bits of your face. But just washing your face and just giving yourself two seconds to just kind of really relax. Use some eye gels. These are from Patchology. Let's whack those on. Oh, I just dropped it. Underneath the eye. And the other one when I find it. No, it's here. Here we go. You can keep them in the fridge as well, so if you don't want to have them by your bedside, too, you can put them in the fridge, and then when you make breakfast in the morning, you can put those on. This is a body wash from Aromatherapy Associates, and it's their Revive Energize and Awaken scent. And it's got, I imagine it's got that lemongrass, oh, it's grapefruit, rosemary. And juniper berry, no lemongrass, but it's brilliant at making you feel more awake in the morning. And then I also use the Ren Atlantic Kelp and Microalgae Anti Fatigue Toning Body Oil. God, that's a mouthful. Um, just find that just giving myself a massage in the morning, um, whether that's my face or my body, just makes me feel more awake. This is really important. I carry this wherever I go. It's water. And like I know people just bang on about water all the time, being saviour to all problems. But if you're tired, then you need to drink more water um, because it's going to give your body a better fighting chance at um, being more energised. And when you're tired, you become more dehydrated. So, water. So another tip is to choose an uplifting fragrance. At the moment, I'm obsessed with. Jo Malone's Grapefruit Cologne. Um, it just makes me feel so much more awake the minute that I spray it on. Um, and He's just waking up so I can talk. So this is Bare Minerals, the, it's called the original. Um, and it's just a, it's a powder foundation, but it's really lightweight on your face. And it just gives you a really light coverage. And it's so quick to apply. That's what I love about it. And also means, it's just by doing your concealer first, so when I go over with this, I just use the brush to buff it all in and then it just saves me time. And then I go over with a cream blush and the reason I use cream is because it gives you more of a youthful, natural looking glow as opposed to powder which can be quite ageing and can also make you look more tired your skin looks tired so this kind of just cheats that Givenchy's highlighter there are loads of brands that do cream highlighters it doesn't have to be an expensive one and I then just do bronzer here and here under my chin just in case the color of my foundation's a 
bit too dark. Just blends it in a bit more. Just frames your face and then bridge my nose. Of course, again, this is not the right brush. But he's waking up, so we need to hurry up. And then just finish with that lipstick. I have it on, I literally don't even use a lip liner or anything. Just blend the two. Pretty quickly before he wakes up or oh, he's got big and I'm just gonna blast my face <laughs> there with dry shampoo. <laughs> Hi! Um, this is my favourite dry shampoo, it's by Living Proof and it's their perfect hair day dry shampoo and it just, it makes you feel like you've washed your hair when you haven't. It also gives your hair incredible volume. <laughs> Might have to get him in to do my mascara. But we all know how to do mascara, right? That's just so you can see. I'll tie that back up. He will pull my hair. I have time to do all this. I literally just do my skincare and then put a bit of mascara on. Maybe a bit of cream blush. Thinking about my diet. And that's really, really important when it comes to getting glowing looking skin and also just making yourself feel more energised. So I eat a lot of vegetables. Um, which I know is not really always what you want to eat when you're tired. I know for like the first eight weeks after having my baby, I just wanted to eat bread and pizza and like cookies because I felt sorry for myself, and that's totally fine, just do it. Um, the only thing is, I slightly regret that now because I wasn't moving around very much because I had a c section and I did put on a bit of weight from that, but hey, hey you know these things happen um, and I think you just have to just go in terms of diet go with your feelings a little bit to an extent you know a certain extent but if you can eat more vegetables and drink more water and eat more fruit then you will just naturally get more energy and that good diet will um, um, will reflect in your skin He's fine. Um, and yeah, nuts, good healthy nuts. And I eat lots of fish. My breakfast is muesli with lots of fruit. And then a typical lunch would be like a nice salad. This is the moment because I'm being really healthy. And then dinner will just be protein like chicken or fish and lots of vegetables. I'm just trying not to eat anything too heavy when I'm on my own at home and then when I go out and see friends I'm you know not a fun sponge and I will have like pizza or whatever um, but yeah at home lots of water cutting down on caffeine um, as much as possible herbal teas and yeah just that good diet is really beneficial to your skin and I mean these bags you know, if you can see, they can cover these today. I'm going to show you <laughs> for the real. I didn't sleep very much last night. I'm going to pick him up. So yeah, basically, that's what I do in a day to try and help myself feel a bit more energised and also just make my skin not look so tired. Um, there's one other product that I do actually use and I'll put a picture in in a minute. It's the Amanda Harrington um, Facial Tanning Mist and I used that yesterday and that's why my face looks so brown. And that's really good if you don't have time to put any makeup on and you just wanna just like quickly give yourself a bit of a color, like more color, more glow to your skin. Um, that's a really good product, especially use that if I don't have time to put any makeup on, I just don't want to. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Lots of water, um, good diet. Uh, lots of energising scents and um, glowy, nice, light makeup, nothing too heavy. Oh my god, I'm so cross. Um, I do do, tend to do more things with my skin in terms of skincare before I go to bed. So I'll do another video on that. Um, but 
that's what I do in a day. I'm gonna go for, oh, you're gonna show everyone your tummy. Oh, that's nice. 